Hey guys, this is Nick from Senko Squad. Today we'll be going over the structure and aspect that we learned from our readings this past week. In the first scene, we see an ambulance taking Bob, the owner of Bob's Burgers, from the restaurant to the hospital as he's fainted. Linda, his wife, is going to be accompanying her husband and leaving the kids to run the restaurant. At first, the kids think they still have the idea that they can run the restaurant, but quickly realize they have no structure and don't know how to run the restaurant, nor do they know the policies and standards that need to run the restaurant. As you can see in the scene, people are getting very disgruntled asking where their food is, and you can see Jean running the restaurant but not knowing how to cook the food, and Louise is just taking orders without much say or communicating with the kitchen. Thus leads to some issues where customers end up leaving, thus causing bad reviews for Bob's Burgers and loss of business. In the third scene, we see that Jean and Louise sit down to talk about how they run the restaurant, what they should do, and how they should run it. In this talk, they decide to establish some structure and go over the structure as well as some standards about how to run the positions of the company. In the fourth scene, we see some documents where it looks like they've been drafting, and you can see from Concise they've drafted a manual that contains all the requirements to run the restaurant as well as some aspects of each position and how each position should work. For example, the order person should take orders directly and then report to the chef so they know exactly how long the order is going to take, as well as if there's any hiccups in the kitchen so they can communicate it appropriately. We'll see how this plays out, but for right now, they think it's going to be a good idea. In the, in the fifth scene, we see that they are going back to open business and then they are taking orders successfully and reporting to each other. Thus, everyone is happy and all the orders are being fulfilled in a timely manner, thus bringing back business to Bob's Burgers. In the final scene, we see that Bob and Linda come back and that they present the ideas to the kids. And the kids end up presenting more ideas and end up talking about the structure. And thus, Bob and Linda adopt the structure which isn't totally flat, as everyone reports under Bob, which the which co-managers under Linda. So they now have structure, and they're now going to be a successful business to run.